This lead code question is called two sum two. Input array is sorted. It says given an array of integers that is already sorted in ascending order, find two numbers such that they add up to a specific target number. The function two sum should return indices of the two numbers such that they add up to the target where index one must be less than index two. Note, your returned answers, both index one and index two are not zero based. You may assume that each input would have exactly one solution and you may not use the same element twice. So what they're saying is that two elements in the array have to add up to the target. You would return their index, but not the index, the index plus one. So let's say the indices that add up to the target are zero and one, you would return one plus two. So let's look at the example. The input array is two, seven, 11, 15, and the target is nine, and the output is one, two, because the elements that add up to the target are the first element and the second element, one and two. All right, so the key to solving this problem is to use two different pointers at once. And by pointer, I don't mean real pointers like in C++. I just mean references to two different elements at once. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna put one pointer at the start of the array. Then you put the other pointer at the end of the array. And then you add up those two elements. In this case, they add up to 17, but the target is nine. So we know that these two elements are greater than the target. What we also know is that the input array is sorted. So what we can do is, since we know that 15 plus two is too much, we can move this down one to something that's less big. So then we add those two up. What's two plus 11? That's 13. All right, so it's still too big. Again, since we know it's sorted, that means we can move the right pointer down one. So let me just get rid of these because we know what they are already. So move this down one. And what does that equal? That equals the nine we need. Let's do one more example with the target being 22. So target is 22. We have a pointer at both ends of the array. So we'll start, what's two plus 15? That gives us 17. That's not enough. So this time we're gonna increase the left pointer by one. So we'll change this to that. And that gives us the 22 we need. All right, what lead code has given us is a function called twosum, which accepts numbers, which is the sorted array, and the target, which is what two elements in the sorted array need to add up to. All right, so remember the first thing we need to do is make two pointers. So let left pointer equal zero. That would be here. And let right pointer equal numbers.length minus one. All right, so that would put the second pointer here. Okay, so remember that our result needs to be in an array. So we need to create an array. So let result equal empty array. So this will hold the indices of the elements that add up to the target, but not really the indices. It's more like the each index plus one. All right, so now we need to loop over the elements in the array. So while left pointer is less than right pointer, it can't be less than or equal to because if the two pointers were ever equal, we'd accidentally be adding the same element twice. All right, so now we need references to both elements at the pointers. So let left element equal numbers, left pointer, This would be the number two and let right element 
equal numbers right pointer. This would be the number 15. Okay, so remember the first thing we have to do is check to see if those two elements add up to, to the target. So if left element plus right element equals the target, what would we do? We would push the indices plus one into the result array, and then we would break out of the while loop. So that would look like this result, which is our result array, dot push left pointer plus one and result dot push right pointer plus one. And then we would break. But that's not the case in our array right now. So we need an else statement. So else if left element plus right element is greater than the target, which is the case in our array, because two plus 15 is greater than nine, what would we need to do? We would need to decrease the right pointer by one, which would look like this. All right, so the next while loop would start and it would check again. Does two plus 11 equal nine? No, so it would check the else if statement. Does the left element plus the right element still exceed the target? It does because 13 is still greater than nine. So it would decrement the right pointer again. One thing to note is that we need one more else statement. Remember we said earlier that if the two elements are less than the target, we would need to increase the left pointer. That's not the case in our example, but we still need it, of course, for cases where that does happen. So else we would do left pointer plus plus. All right, so now we're in the next while loop and it checks, does the left element plus the right element equal the target? It does because two plus seven equals nine. So it would push zero plus one, which is one, and one plus one, which is two, into our result array, giving us one, two. And then what would we need to do? We would just need to return result. All right, let's run the code. Looks good. Let's submit. All right, since our answer was done in linear time, it was faster than about 90% of JavaScript submissions. As usual, the code and written explanation are linked down below. Remember that if you like the video, please like it and subscribe. See you next time.